Hello everyone, Chandler here. Today I am I actually kind of started this and I didn't think I was going to be filming. I was like, I could do like a GoPro thing or make this a video. I was like, I don't know if this is going to work. This probably won't work. But I was like, I might as well try. And I've got a lot of bunch of plywood like this, so might as well try and see if it works. And if it doesn't, no big deal. Um, but as I was doing it, I'm like, oh, this might actually work. So I was like, might as well make this a live video. How's it going, Ivan? How are you doing today? So, if you don't know, if you can't guess already, I'm building something. Um, it is this shape. It's going to be like this. So I got this little piece of metal right here. That'll go there. That'll go there. And we get ourselves a handboard to be right here. And roll back. <laughs> so, I've got some more stuff to cut and measure. Um, my next step is measuring this 2x4. I'm just going to use, where's my straight edge? I need a smaller straight edge for this project. But this one definitely works. Um, yeah. So I need three of these. So that's what I'm doing next to keep this project going. How's it going, John? How are you doing today? Uh, don't worry, Ivan. I will be doing this for a bit. I'm going to try to get this project done, hopefully. The only thing that might not work smoothly like I want it to is fixing this on the ramp. Um, I might do Gorilla Glue and try to hold it in place, which I think it'll work. But I don't think it's going to dry by the time this video will be going, so we might skate it without coping first. But yeah, so let's get two more of these and then I'll go cut it over here. And I've got a bunch of scraps so I'm just pulling them in there. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't have to be quality wood. Is this long enough? <laughs> oh, it's just short. Hmm. It's just short. Let me see. That'd be perfect. This is janky, but okay, so that's the distance. Yeah, it's short. I want it longer than that. Maybe it'll work. Uh eh. no, I'm gonna do this right. Well, it's not really right, but I'm not gonna use this. Another project for that piece of wood. Okay, let's get just a longer. Uh, actually, yeah, why not? Yeah, this will work. I got this piece of wood and it's beat up and it's got a nasty edge. I wouldn't really use this for anything else. But since this project, I'm not really worried about the weight of how it's gonna hold itself. How's it going, Jonathan? How are you doing today? I'm glad you're doing good, John. My middle name is John, so we're all like brothers. That. I'm doing this the weirdest way possible. lines together and then cut from there. This is not how you're supposed to measure. I'm not too worried about accuracy. Okay, I'm going to unplug you guys. Ugh. Bring you over to my other messy part of my workshop. And do some cutting. this on a 45 degree angle. Earlier today I was cutting some trim for windows. That's not what I'm doing right now though. Glasses on. They look pretty cool, right? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do it. This looks like a little bit of a... I want it to be long enough. 
I'd rather be too long than not long enough. Okay, it's so a little bit on that side line. This one I can't be so picky about my color. <laughs> all that sawdust fell off. It's back on. There we go. So this room doesn't get so sawdusty. Okay, now my original one I liked. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Very bad connection. Sorry if it was choppy over there. Let me plug you back in. And the connection should be better now. Da -da 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 -da. Oh yes, please be safe. The wood smells nice. I'm glad you enjoyed the wood smell. I think it smells nice too. Yeah, I'm I'm a pretty safe guy when it comes to construction stuff, I think. But I'm not super worried about construction of this right now. Okay. One goes at the bottom, just like that. One I'm going to put here or so, as much as I can in this direction, without affecting the curve. And then one at the top. Usually you would put them down the edge like this, but because of I need to touch you guys up a bit, sorry. Because of how small this is gonna be, I'm not gonna be putting too much pressure on it. I'm not gonna put it too big for right here because I don't think I need to. Okay. the structural integrity of this that much, honestly. I brought screws in here. Yeah, there. Some I need to go grab more. This is a very off the cuff. Oh, I know what Copper's whining about his tennis balls in the couch. Okay, we got one in. Sorry you guys are sideways. Hopefully you're enjoying this. I'm a Casey Scooter Rider. Love your content. Awesome. Thanks, Benjamin. I appreciate it. I'm not good at scooter riding at all. Go to Pearson all the time and try. hope to try the indoor skate park. I was at the indoor skate park uh, a couple days ago. It was really fun. I skated four hours. And then I was at Pearson today and filmed a couple videos. But yeah, if you're ever around, if you're down to film, I'm down to film you. Uh, wait one second, sorry. Uh, I gotta go get <laughs> Copper's tennis ball and then get some screws. He's barking up the wrong tree. It wasn't there at all. Poor puppy. Da -da 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 -da. What am I building? I am building an atomic bomb. No, if you can't guess from this shape, 
It's going to be a quarter pipe for my handboard. So I'm pretty stoked on it. Uh, okay. Do the next piece of wood. Right here. Actually, let's just get a nail through this, or a screw. And then we can line this up. Let's just do this for balancing sake. There we go, nice and flush. And it's gonna spin. And that's okay. Oh, good enough. One there, one more in there, and it's good. Okay. okay. One more, and that is on the very top. Okay. Is this looking like a quarter pipe so far? What do you guys think? Finally. <laughs> do I like wrestling? Uh, I had three brothers, so I wrestled them. But like professional wrestling? Not really. Or like, I was homeschooled, so I didn't really like do any high school wrestling or anything. Okay, we got one side done. You flip it over. Put this up flush with these. And as long as we stay like that, we should be flush all around. And then we're just gonna put the other piece on there and we're good to go. What am I gonna use for the rain part? <laughs> I found this kind of flimsy piece of particle board, I think is what it is. I don't think it's cardboard, but it's got a bend to it, so I'm hoping I can shape it that way. I'm gonna shape it and then I'll cut it with probably just like a straight edge and go from there. This part should be easy, just sinking screws now. This is fun. I enjoy doing this a lot. This is a pretty soft wood, as you guys can tell. It just kind of just goes in there pretty easily. <laughs> Are you certified with the National Woodworking Association? The NWA? Oh my gosh, yes I am. How did you know? I just had last night my first NWA meeting and they told everyone to go build something. So I'm building this. Oh, that's not what I wanted. So that's okay. Let's see how it is. Okay. Bare bones done. Oh my gosh. See, that's what I don't want. This is probably because I'm very, very, very new at this whole building thing. <laughs> but this is not what I want. So, which one looks better? I think this one looks better. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put some foam in this corner. I think I have some foam over here. Oh, I was thinking about that. Oh, yeah, I do. But is foam enough? How much of a gap are we talking here? Quite a bit. So, let's get proper. Let's 
get a sham. A shim is just any sort of piece of wood you can fit somewhere. I think that'll do. This is going to be so janky. So this is the corner I'm trying to raise. I'm just putting a piece of wood here. This whole project, I'm not buying anything. That's why I'm not like too worried about how I do any of this. Put my shim down. Put this very sticky adhesive foam. Now, doesn't really do it. Problem solved. Slash averted. Da, 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 da. What type of dog do I have? I think he's a beagle, maybe greyhound. We, the people we got, we got him off Craigslist from a vet's office, like two hours west of where we live. He's 50 bucks, so we made the drive, made it an evening thing and just did it. And um, when we got him online, they said he was a beagle lab and he is not a beagle lab. He might be a beagle and he kind of looks like, he very much looks like a beagle when he's a puppy. Um, but I, we don't think he's a beagle. Or he, we don't think he's like full beagle, definitely. Because his body looks like a greyhound. So we've just been telling people he's a beagle, beagle greyhound. We don't really know, if I'm being honest. Uh, do you watch me a lot? Thank you very much. The ones that go wolf and bark. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Coasters from 54th Street. Hook me up, man. Oh, Caleb, whenever I see you again, dude, I'm going to finish this. Hopefully tomorrow I'm going to film a video comparing all different handboard decks, and then I'll give this to you because I want to use this because it's a fresh hangnail handboard deck with the grip on it. So, once I've Got it good. Because I like this deck. I like it a lot. So I'll give it to you once I film the video. I just want to use this as a good presentation. So, everything's going right. That'll go right there. That's going to be sick. Next, this is just, it's like broken in this corner over here and like water stained. It's not the most quality. Piece. So it's gonna be kind of like that. So nothing really to do left, but put it on. Ooh, maybe this way. Yeah, this way. Okay, let's do some measuring. This is. Uh, 11, foot, 11 inches and it's like barely under one foot. Where's my pencil? It's warped. This thing is warped everywhere. We're gonna try to get it flat though. So let's mark just a 1 16th underneath 12 feet. Go down a ways. 1 16th under one foot. Then, <laughs> put that on the floor. We take this, straight edge. I'm gonna use this to measure, but oh well. Line it up with both marks, make sure it's flush. Just like that. Are still barking. Do, 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 do some more handboarding tricks. For sure, I'm going to. Uh, what's the initial revolution? I have. Should, uh, <laughs> no, I don't have any opinion. Sorry. Favorite TV show? Oh, that's a good question. Sherlock Holmes, the BBC version, is really good. It's very short, but it's very good. 
I almost don't even consider that a TV show. It's almost like mini movies. Um, the Office, Parks and Rec, White Collar, Psych, The Flash. I like the first two seasons. Or maybe just the first season. Um, Avatar The Last Airbender. I love like that show. Uh, King of the Hill. Okay, I need to go get my straight edge and start cutting this. So, I'll be back. Found Copper's toy. That was the most, this is the most sporadic, I guess this guy stay down there. The most sporadic live stream I've had, but it's been fun. <laughs> Can I fingerboard? No, I cannot. Season seven on The Office? Awesome, man. Yeah, I'm glad you enjoy, this is, yeah, this is my basement, isn't it? Uh, Avatar's amazing. Hope when I go live, good, I'm glad you enjoyed it, Tyler. All right. And I'm not too concerned for cutting on this. Um, just because um, this, I don't care if this gets cut or what. It's just, these are all scrap pieces. Oh, you know what I should do? I should be smart. Cut my straight edge on the item I'm using to cut and then just run my knife across to the metal. Oh come on. I guess I should do down here so I can hold it with the metal. Line, line, press. Okay. Am I ambidextrous? Not really. Decently clean cut. Now we've got the length cut. Oh my gosh, Copper already lost his toy again. Which way did I like it? I think I liked it this way. Oops, stuff in my way. Nope, I liked it the other way. I cut it too short. I think it's just bowing in the middle. I know this looks so professional. Mark this while I have my finger. Let's give me a little extra to play with. Copper.
Oh, it's Aaron Kyra. Oh, hi, Aaron Kyra. How are you doing, my dude? I don't know if this one's going to cut as easily. Maybe. Okay, done with the straight edge. I'm almost done with this, and I'm about to skate it. so close and I am will not be upset if this fails because I'm happy with the shape what the heck happy with the shape that I've made so I can always replace this product with something better and higher quality do is just work my way down I think just like that yeah let's see how this takes screws real folks. I think I cut it too short as well. Too short this way. Uh-oh. Splitting my side piece. Don't want that. Too much Chandler. Yeah, definitely can split it. Splitting is possible. See, I didn't, didn't angle it enough. Usually you wouldn't go this low, or you'd use shorter screws, but these shoes are these screws are already pretty short, so I'm angling it quite a bit. Yeah, I did this cover piece too short. I'm okay with that for right now. This is just very much test. But kind of janky. <laughs> Forgot about that. But last thing to do be oh, can I just pin this in here? That'd be rad. Oh I got a top piece of nose for getting something. Top piece. So we might not get to do much with the coping, or it will probably fall off a lot. And that's okay. I don't think I have a straight edge to go against anymore. Okay.
Whoa. I wasn't done with the straight edge. Hope this is entertaining. I follow a YouTube channel called I Like to Make Stuff, and it's just a guy making things. And he talks his way through it. Uh, it's edited, of course, it, and it's very professional. I really like watching it. It inspired me to make a, a couple of things in my life. But, yeah, hopefully you guys have enjoyed my edition of I like to make stuff. Janky. This is all just scraps from around my house. For sure. Probably looks janky too, huh? stays in place. <laughs> do I watch Sam Tabor? Yeah, I do. Uh, we follow each other on Instagram. I, I, I don't think he watches my YouTube, but yeah. Da, 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 da. Plash that thing with stickers. <laughs> I don't know. I like simplicity. Okay, so... We have here that needs maybe another screw there. But let's just. Oh. oh man, okay. So I might need a piece of wood right here to push this up flat. Because that's like Boeing. Boeing 747. First trick. <laughs> yeah, because you can see like a little air under there. You can see light. So I need to push that up and flat against there. Oh, the fire stall. Okay. Let's change camera angle. Actually, I want to skate it regular, honestly. So, we put this over here. We're going to unplug you guys from the wall. Ah! Plug in over here. This might be too close. Now you can see me over there in the mirror. Oh my, we are the moving. You are the moving. You are so much moving. Yeah, you can definitely see the light now. Or I can. Right now, it's too much. So good. And this transition isn't too bad. This is Tech Deck wheels, so that's not the greatest. But what I'll probably do is take a 2x4 and push this outwards a little bit to where this is more this direction. So it's this is more flush. And so I can do that. Want stalls. Yeah, 
some skinny here. Right now. <laughs> oh, let's try kick flip nose stall. <laughs> Tray flips are fun on this thing. Proper flips. I don't know if that was proper. <laughs> yeah, so we'll raise that up. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is really is like staying in place that much. See the wheels get cut in there. That's awesome. I like it. Okay, I think I'm going to end this video unless you guys have any trick requests on this. Da -da 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 -da. Would skate again. What, you're singing? I don't know what I'm singing. Uh, I have Spotify, and there's a thing called Discover Weekly, and so it takes songs you've listened to and adds new songs similar to it. And one of them today was like, da 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 I don't know what it is though. I forgot. But it's obviously catchy. Oh, the heel. Oh, it's a laser, I think. You guys can see it. I tried watching the camera. <laughs> I guess you can see my face in there, can't you? There you are. Varial heel. That's not a I did laser. There it is. We shove. Spin. Backside spin. Oh, that was fun. Whoa. Slowly pushing this. I wish I could do that. Oh man. I love that sound. Metal on metal. That was good. Let's try a hard flip. Sketch and hard flip. I need to wait more time. Nolly train. Nolly is hard. I got used to that. All right. Let's try to end this video. Uh, tray flip, no stall, switch tray. Do a little bit of an angle here. Give me a bit of an angle here. Here's Copper's toy. This is hard. I gotta pop it early. <laughs> Not that early. Whoa! I was doing it. I don't understand popping on this yet. Pop 
popping like this, I only have that much room. Rather than all of that. Also, this is a harder surface. There's a little bit of a give to it. So when I put that piece in the middle, it should alleviate that. Take that favorite Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2, probably. That's what comes to mind first because I played that the most. Because I have three brothers and we just played the multiplayer. The new one looks cool though. Now that I have a gaming computer, I might get back into it. But I just bought one of the old Assassin's Creed games. Okay, I'll see you guys. Thank you for watching. This has been really fun and very different for me. If you want to see more stuff like this, let me know with a comment. If you're watching this live or if you're not, um, let me know. Um, and I'll do more stuff like this because I enjoy creating things. And I have a lot of materials here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good day and God bless. And exit and...